Hey guys, it's Georgia. So for today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to create these really gorgeous loose curls. And to create these, I'm going to be using the MAP curl stick, which I recently bought. It comes with three different attachments for here. So you can change between the size of the stick part. Is that what you'd call it? And this is the biggest one in the set, which is a 25mm one. And it's what I'm going to be using today to create these curls. I'm going to start by sectioning off the top half of my hair and pinning it in place with a butterfly clip. I'm then going to be taking the curling wand and wrapping my hair around the barrel. I'm making sure I wrap it away from my face so that it sits better and looks more natural. I'm holding my hair on the barrel for around 15 to 20 seconds, but that time might change depending on how thick your hair is. I'm then holding the curl off my curling wand for a few seconds just to let it cool down so that it doesn't drop. Then I'm just going to repeat this for this side of the hair. Then I'm going to be taking this bottle of hairspray, which by the way is huge, and spraying it all over the curls to set them in place. Then I'm going to curl the other side of my hair and making sure to curl away from my face. Now that both bottom layers are done, I'm going to let down some more hair and then just pin my fringe back up and basically just curl this section that I just let down. Now for the fringe, you want to let down your fringe and part it wherever you want to part it. Today I was feeling the side fringe. A little trick for if your hair is dropping like mine was starting to do, try spraying some hairspray in before you actually curl. This lets it set as you're curling your hair. So I'm just taking sections of my fringe and curling them away from my face, then holding them in my hand as it cools and letting it go. Then I did this to the other side of my fringe too. I then added one more layer of hairspray. Then to give my hair some volume and texture without teasing it, I decided to use some dry shampoo and you can do this even if your hair is clean because it will give it some volume and texture without damaging it like teasing does. Then using my fingers, I'm going to comb through my hair to just separate the curls and kind of make them less formed. I'm going to brush them a bit too, just to kind of take out that springiness from them. And then one of my favourite things to do is flip my hair upside down and then shake my hair out. And this gives you that really natural and woke up like this look. <laughs> Then I just fixed it up until I was happy with what I had. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know down below in the comments what video you guys want to see next. And make sure if you haven't already, please subscribe. And I will see you guys soon. Bye lovelies!